Well, Lindsay, I actually just talked to a dad. He tells me he was up all night checking his son's flight. He's coming from Denver. A good news that flight is on time this morning. Right now, an 11:15 Southwest flight to Chicago. That one is canceled. Also, a 10:40 flight from Dallas. But at this point, everything is still on time. So if you are heading to the airport, Port Authority tells me this time of year it is very important to be in the security line at least two hours early because those wait times can quickly change. One minute, this can be completely empty as we're seeing it right now. In the next, it can be packed with a line to the door. We saw that happen yesterday in just a matter of 15 minutes. This was unexpected. You know, they tell you to get here two hours early, and I got here maybe an hour and 55 early, and I'm glad I did. And here's a look at that fast growing line. So plan ahead. The busiest times are going to be 11 to noon and then 4 to 6 in the evening. And to speed up the process, know what is allowed in your carry on. If you plan to pack Thanksgiving sides or desserts with you, anything solid is generally okay. If it's something liquid, like say cranberry sauce, that will need to go in a 3.4 ounce container or just put it in your checked bag. Now, conditions nationally, as we've heard, are changing by the minute. So make sure you have your airlines app for alerts to avoid the mess. Some people switch their flights to get out early. They were accommodating and changed it for no charge. Um, so we're beating the storm back. We did not want to be stuck in um, lines or potential flights being canceled. So we decided to come out Tuesday. So if you have any questions, look for the people walking around here. They are wearing red vests. They are airport staff, and they are here specifically this week to help you. Live at the airport, Andrea Henderson, Wink News Now.